Good afternoon everyone. I'm just about to get ready for my last run before my race on Saturday, which is the Tauranga Cross Country. I'm just going to go for a 40 minute easy run around my usual loop. So I'll show you guys the usual loop I go around. And yeah, I'm going to do some strides as well. And strides are pretty much just short little fast intervals to like sort of get familiar with race pace. And yeah, let's get into it. These are the shoes I'll be racing with on the weekend. They've got a carbon plate and those laces are just triathlon laces. I just haven't been bothered to take them off. Yeah, it's raining a bit today. So yeah, let's hope it doesn't pour. Let's get into it. GPS is loaded, so let's go. Let's hope I don't get a stitch because I had coffee literally 20 minutes before this, which was not a good idea. But yeah, let's hope for the best. The reason I haven't done any swimming videos is because, well, I've got a squad of like 15 people and they're mostly girls. So if I bring a camera, they'll be a bit sus. <laughs> so probably for swimming videos, I'll just do videos where I just like explain what we did and I play a video game in the background or something. Hopefully that's good. Give me any ideas in the comments. Heart rate 152, going at like 450 pace. It's an easy run, so I should probably slow down. I've got a cross country coming up, so maybe I shouldn't be running on the roads and I should get the feel for running on the grass. Here we go. This is going to be very wet and mushy. Oh my god. Oh, this does not feel the best. Yeah, this isn't the most entertaining place to run because it's just a lot of straight roads, but eh, it's bearable. It's better than the treadmill at least. Let's run around this section for a bit of extra mileage. Okay, we're finally on a new road now. Just made a right turn from there. We're about 1.5k in. We're about 1. 1.8k in now. Hey man, I can feel the coffee. <laughs> I really hope I don't get a stitch. If I tell my mind I'm gonna get a stitch, then I'm gonna get a stitch. But I have to believe and trick my mind that I'm not, then I most likely won't. Past the 2k mark in 9.51. Normally there's horses here. They've just decided to leave me. Unacceptable. Not gonna lie, having the phone in my goddamn pocket is not the most comfortable thing in the world. Plus three performance condition, that's good. That means that my heart rate is lower than usual at this pace, which is what we want. I'm just going to clap my hands. It's okay. I just want to, oh crap, I can't say that on YouTube. <laughs> Man, music is really good. Anyway. It's just it. Oh fuck, I forgot the lyrics. They said it's gonna be 90% chance of rain. Bro, the weather forecast is a fraud. There's a puddle. Should we run in the puddle? We're gonna run in the puddle. Oh boy. Oh, it's weird. With a carbon plate, you don't even like absorb the water. Just completed 4.2k in my 20 minutes. As you can see here, yeah, this route is just a lot of long straight roads, roads and paths. It's not the most visually interesting route. Okay, we're about 5k in now. This is a more of an interesting road now. But my phone has caused my pocket to go inside out. So this looks really weird. <laughs> We're approaching the first and only hill of this loop. <laughs> Two cars just came flying from down there and it scared the crap out of me. Up we go, up the hill. Oh boy. Nah, it's not that bad. It's probably like 2% elevation. Speed limit over there is 50k an hour. We're going too fast. Let's, oh crap, those are deep puddles. I should not have run in there, holy crap. And there's a car behind me. Oh boy. Man, those puddles were a lot deeper than I thought. Okay, we're currently about 6k done in like just under 30 minutes. So yeah, going good. Oh, there's a big puddle over here. I don't know if I want to run in it. Okay, we're running in it. Oh my god. That was a bad idea. I'm drenched. <laughs> Why did I do that? Why is it that I just, whenever I see a puddle, I just think, oh yeah, run in it. That's a good idea. <laughs> yes, I saw a puddle and I didn't run in it. Progress. Running on rocky terrain. We're about like 7.3k in. Bro, I'm just like a game trying to avoid the big pebbles that mess up my feet. We're on the final stretch now. Like in about a kilometer, well no, no not a kilometer, like 500 meters is my house. Parkour jump, wait, never mind, that's way too big for a parkour jump, holy crap. I don't want to fall in there. And we're back on the driveway, but we're not done yet. Because I'm going to do a few strides. Let's go. Are we filming? Oh, it's upside down, what the hell? Uh, Okay, yeah, so that's 8k done in around 40 minutes. Bring on the strides. All right, let's begin strides number one. First bit of strides actually felt really good. Going at like 310 pace per kilometer. Yeah, it's a bit more to go and then I'll, I'm done. Okay, final rep of strides, here we come. Let's make this one the fastest. All right, guys, that's easy running strides done. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, make sure to subscribe because I'm going to be making a video on my race, which will be in two days. Wish me luck.